Hello friends, welcome to Ayur Yoga Agile Lead Program. So I am today sharing a video with exam tips which explains you in brief about BNYS exams and how to manage the time in the examination hall. So if you aren't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe and share the video with your friends. So let's begin the video. Before starting, I wish to say that you are the authors of your answer papers, which means you are writing with your own skill and never by heart the things. Try to understand the concept so that you can write in your own sentences. This will help you to save the time a lot. Because instead of thinking a lot what you are by hearted, uh, the own sentences with the similar meaning will help you to write the exams in a smooth way and you will get a good marks as well. So starting uh, with the time what you spend in the examination hall, it will be around 3 hours which is uh, 180 minutes and uh, total marks is 80 in case of BNYS. So let's split the marks. So there will be total uh, 50 pages uh, uh, which will be divided into of, uh, MCQs, 10 markers and 5, five markers. Nowadays they are uh, numbering the page uh, with the question numbers. So be careful while writing the answers. Please cross check the page number with your question number. How the marks is split? Uh, it like MCQ had uh, 1 marks uh, each for 10 questions and uh, two questions uh, of 10 marks and uh, 10 questions of 5 marks total uh, aggregated into 80 marks. So coming to the pages allotted for MCQs, uh, there will be one page to each question and uh, 10 marks, uh, uh, there will be five pages to each question and five marks, you will be having three pages to each question. So things to remember in the exam is you have to check the number of pages in the answer paper uh, once they give you the booklet of answer sheets. And the other thing is read the questions thoroughly, especially in case of MCQs. There will be slight tricky questions in MCQs. So read thoroughly the question and uh, give time to understand the options as well. Next coming to check the question number and the page number. Now the page numbers are being allotted with the question number. For example, if there are 5 pages uh, in uh, 10 marker, if the uh, 10, uh, 10 marker question number is 1, then all the 5 pages will be marked as 01010101. So please be careful while writing the answers because you should not write the answer of the first question in the page of the second question. So this is how the pages are allotted as well as the marks are split. The most difficult part coming is uh, how to manage the time in the examination hall. So coming to the time management, uh, here I wish to say that exam hall is the place where you feel time is too short. The most common scenario or what happens with the students is once they come out of the exam hall, when we ask how, how was the exam, all are going to say the time exam was easy but the time was short. So why this happens? Usually we neglect the time division like we don't divide the times accordingly and we write the answers according to that. Uh, the thing is uh, actually what happens is uh, we, we are more focused on uh, uh, writing the in a very beautiful manner all those things but actually what required in examination is the presentation is required for some amount but you have to write the answers in a short and sweet way not in paragraph wise instead you have to write in a flow chart way or diagrammatic way that will be more uh, presentable and it will be understood by the evaluator as well so splitting to the time part uh, so time how you can split into different parts uh, first of all, you should carry a watch in the examination hall and you have to keep it in front of you so that you can uh, look at the watch uh, uh, meanwhile writing the answers. So coming to the time split, uh, MCQs, uh, it has 10 questions. So 
if you give at least one minute for one questions it will be around 10 minutes you are using 10 minutes for 10 questions some of the questions you might finish it early so you will gain some of the time in the, in that too. some of the questions might be tricky so you may spend some more time in that so it's not going to uh, hamper your time management but you have to just focus that you have to finish that 10 questions within 10 minutes of time if you are spending more time on one question please avoid that question and attempt in the last so that uh, you can save that time to write other questions coming to the 10 marks uh, each question you spend 20 minutes so you need 40 minutes overall to finish two questions it has five pages so try to write in a faster way so that you will cover all the points to write in the answer sheet with the flow chart or with the help of the diagrams and the next is five marker where uh, uh, you get 10 questions if you spend in and around 10 minutes to 12 minutes to write three pages then you will finish it off within 120 minutes to so overall uh, so you will get 10 minutes plus 40 minutes plus 120 minutes so overall it is 170 minutes you have 180 minutes in your hands but what happens to the remaining 10 minutes so the remaining 10 minutes will be lost either uh, to read the questions or turning the pages or some other miscellaneous things like adjusting yourself while writing the uh, answers every all those things because each second matters in the examination hall and those times cannot be managed uh, by ourselves because it's lost anyways so you have to finish your exam within 170 minutes so you have to be writing it continuously without any break uh, so your thought process should be completely focused on the questions and the content what you are going to write and you should write in your own words so that it will help you to finish the exams in the given time or else if you are by hearting the things and you are writing the exact things on the paper then you take time to recall the things and you lose the time while uh, thinking to those things please to share and spread among your friends so that it might help you people to write the exams in an easy manner and finish the exams within given time if you need any other informations regarding bnys or subject wise informations you can just put a comment in the comment section so that i will get back to you and mail to my mail id which i will give it in the description so please do follow share and like the video